Welcome back to my block, Jags. I am Denaro Scurry. And it looks like Tim Tebow, the Tebow Experience, the Tebow Make-A-Wish Foundation, whatever you want to call it, has ended. He got cut just probably like 30 minutes ago. He, he announced that he got cut. And thank the Jaguars for giving him his opportunity and fulfill whatever wish or dream that he had that started in February. Um, am I surprised? I am kind of surprised he got cut after the first game of the season because knowing Urban Meyer, how Urban likes to do things on his own move. He likes, I'm saying, he runs his own show. Don't nobody really face him. He do what he want to do. I'm surprised that he cut him after the first um, preseason game. But um, ridicule, ridicule and pressure from everyone else is the reason why Tebow got cut. Granted, you can't have... You can't have Tebow. Well, how do you look at it? You can't have Tebow on a team, a player on the team that looks that bad at a position, but then you keep him past, you know what I'm saying, all these cuts until the final cut or bring him into the season. When you have other people who's been playing these playing these positions their whole lives and went through college and went undrafted and whatever they may, whatever their path may be, and you cut them, but you end up keeping this guy. I mean, optics of it doesn't look right. And honestly, that's the main reason why Tebow got cut um, and his play. Preseason, he didn't block well. I remember the very first video when, T when we signed Tebow, I said this. I said um, I wasn't really excited about it because he can't block. Point blank period. I was like, he played quarterback. There was no way he was going to go out there and block. Um, and that's exactly what he showed. He, went, he couldn't block. You seen him? Throw that goofy ass block where he threw his body into the linebacker. Granted, the linebacker didn't make the tackle, but he threw his body in the linebacker. And then he got just fucking just thrown on the ground. The motherfucker jumped off the line head first to, to block. And the guy just whipped right past him and threw him on the ground. So um it was obvious. He wasn't gonna make the team. If he wanted to play tight end, he he needed a little bit more time to actually learn the tight end position. Go through tight end camp, all that shit, and he just didn't have enough time. It was cool. I mean, I'm not gonna root for. I'm not gonna root against the guy while he's on my team. So he wore the jersey, he had the helmet on. I wanted to see him do good, but in my mind, I was like, maybe if he does somewhat good, they're gonna bring him in the. They're gonna bring him into the regular season, have him doing college style stuff, jump passes, have him running the ball, wildcat, all that type of stuff. So I kind of was looking forward to see him in the regular season. But he didn't make it there. I mean, his play just didn't make it there. And I'm off real. He only got cut because of the preseason game. If he was, if it was still, still practice, still practice, still practice, still practice, still practice. From everything they showed us in practice, Tebow catching the ball, Tebow with one on ones, da 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 da. And I know the media. I know that's purposely done by the Jaguars media to only show Tebow when he's doing good. Um, but if it was, if it wasn't for the preseason game, he'll still been on the team. So I'm pretty sure his career, his football career is done. I don't think no other team is going to try to pick him up at tight end. I'll be shocked, honestly. I'll be utterly shocked if another team picks him up and have him on their team. But, yeah, this experiment, all this uh, this experiment, this little Make-A-Wish Foundation, all this shit is over, you know what I'm saying, the city of Jacksonville and for the Jaguars. Yeah, kind of sucks. I mean, I got my fuck, I got my Gator shirt on right now, and I gotta. This came out of nowhere while I'm so, and I gotta do this, and I hate to see it, but um, yeah. I mean, another Gator. I know this is random, but Taven Bryant, we might as well cut him too, bro. Just get him on out of there. Get that boy up out of here, man. We tired of seeing him. Point blank period. Just get him out of here. But uh, yeah, man, it's over for Tebow, at least here in Jacksonville. Uh, I doubt. Ah. I doubt another team will pick him up, but it'll be, it'll be, I'll be surprised if a team does pick him up and try to do something with him. But who knows? I mean, it's the NFL, it's 2021. Who knows what could happen? Uh, let me know what you guys think in the comments.